Here's a sample formula on how to use an AND, and uh, with an OR statement. So let's quickly just read these definitions again. So AND checks whether all arguments are true and returns true if all arguments are true. Um, and then let's flip to OR. Checks whether any of the arguments are true and returns true or false. Returns false only if all arguments are false. So you can see here we've got an AND as well as an OR function in this validation rule. So the AND brackets start here, right? We're going to open this bracket, meaning everything in here has to be true until this last bracket because all arguments within an AND have to be true in order to trigger the validation rule. So we're going to start off with a simple and is blank. So title has to be blank. After that, we have a comma and then we have an or function with two arguments inside of it. So what do we know about or functions? Checks whether any of the arguments are true. So if one of these are true, then this or function is true. And then if this single and is true, the whole statement is true which would trigger a validation rule so and title is blank as well as phone or mobile phone is blank will trigger this validation rule you can't have a blank title and um zero phone numbers change that you at least need two phone numbers right because one of these has to be blank to be true. So if there's no title, you need two phone numbers. Not really a, a great sales use case, but just to get the record to fire here. So let's go over to a lead. And test this out. So I'm going to come here. We have working contacted. We have a blank title. And you can see we've got multiple validations here, but the one we wanted to fire fired. When the title's blank, you need to have at least two phone numbers. So I'm just going to take this, copy it back down here, say CFO. And then you can see we got rid of the other ones. We just need rating to not be null. This is a separate validation rule. We got it to save. So if I come in here, boom. Perfect. Well, that's just a quick example, um, again, on how to use kind of an and, and uh, with an or function in a validation rule. Um, stay tuned for more formula videos.